public expects us to have the latest and greatest uh, technology, uh, commonly referred to as the CSI effect. Although we're not where Hollywood has put us, we're pretty close when we use our scanner out in the scenes. They say that a picture is worth a thousand words. I think utilizing the scanner, it's, you know, we're at a million plus words when we show them the, you know, the true view. If the goal of creating Register 360 was to simplify post-production, I think that goal has been achieved. It certainly seems less intimidating. It seems user-friendly. I like the drag and drop features, the auto alignment features. I think these are all things that uh, will be less intimidating for uh, non-proficient Cyclone users to be willing to delve into the post-production world of 3D laser scanning. Register 360, uh, it's not going to be as intimidating for the detectives to come back and, and finish their work product from the field. It'll give you know, our, our one detective currently assigned to it a break while others can jump in and utilize the software. The ease of use is going to improve uh, the, the quality of the product put out by the office. I believe that more detectives will be able to use it within the office. Uh, there's going to be less of an intimidation factor when it comes to using the product. And I think uh, overall it'll improve the workflow. I believe we have six or seven detectives who will use the Leica scanner and then when we come back to processing it's done by one detective. Whereas with the new Register 360 software I believe that all those detectives will be able to uh, utilize the program themselves. We also got the opportunity to demo Jetstream which certainly appears to have some great options for us in the field of bringing people back to a crime scene that they may not have had the opportunity to be at because we were there documenting it, however, years later we can put them back into that scene.